Okay, here we're showing the displacement of um, uh, copper in an unknown copper compound by the magnesium turnings here. So that's a very unstable magnesium, of course, because it's magnesium metal and we all know magnesium would prefer to be in the plus two oxidation state. So let's see what happens when that um, reactive magnesium metal comes into contact with this copper solution. So hopefully you guys can see the copper precipitating out there. The reaction is very exothermic, right? You can see that bubbles, it's hot coming off there. And of course, a little bit of acidity. I don't know if you guys can tell, but the solution is starting to clear up a little bit. Like the blue color is going away. Why is that? Because copper in solution is blue, of course, and what's happening is all that magnesium there on the top is reacting with the copper in solution. So once all that copper in solution comes uh, and makes uh, copper zero, or the copper metal there, of course, there will be no more blue in the solution. I don't know how how long I want to record this oh, for. <laughs> so I could turn up the stirring. So. Nah, don't worry about it. Well, anyways, hopefully you can see that it is getting uh, less dark blue. Is that, do you guys confirm that? Yes. Yeah, I agree with that. Um, eventually it will become, well, now it's very kind of pale green blue and eventually it will become clear. So I'm not going to stick around for that because it'll probably be five minutes and I don't have enough thing to say in that. <laughs> <laughs> the one thing I do want to talk about uh, is that this is a single displacement reaction. So um, I guess try to figure out what the reaction equation is. Well, if it were a known copper compound, I guess you guys don't know what copper compound you've got, so not yet. But anyways, thanks a lot, guys. See you later.